Hey, what's going on, city slickers? And all my slickerettes. Ladies first. Check this out. This vlog is real quick because I got to watch the news that just started. I ain't been up to date with stuff. Um, I've been a little busy. But let me just tell you something. One chick I seen the other day, she was like, hey, you remember that girl you saw me with last week? I said, yeah. She said she passed away two days after you saw us. Then this uh, nurse told me she works in a nursing home. And she's like, people are dying, this and that. You got to put gloves on, keep your mask on. I don't know what's going on with the Jewish community, but I heard that they rioting in Brooklyn. Something about they don't want to wear a mask. I heard they shut down Spring Valley. They shut down Monty. And um, they shutting a lot of stuff down. So um, because of that, they're going to shut down everything now. So I advise you all to go shopping, stock up. I'm stocking up on rice and beans. I don't even drink coffee. My mother used to drink coffee, but I'm going to still stock up on Bustelo. Just in case. You never know. So rice and beans. I'm going to spend like 300 on canned goods. Get some meat. I'm going to try to get another refrigerator. If you got to get a generator, get it now before the Warriors get there. Because once the Warriors get to Home Depot and Home Depot is empty, they're not going to get a truck the next day. No, the truck drivers ain't going to come out. The truckers is not coming out. And if the trucks do come out, they're not getting out the truck. They'll pull up in Home Depot, let them take everything out the back, and they're going to keep going. So don't be a sitting duck, bro. Don't get caught sucking your thumb, bro. It's here. It's back. Green light, puppy hurt. Let me go check this out. Hold on. Guys, I'm watching the news. Um, I got to end this vlog right now. You got to understand, um, during this epidemic, you know, um, cops, cops can only do but so much. So remember, you have to protect yourself. If somebody try to come up in here looting, they're going to get shot. They're going to get bit. But nah, nah. And I got my machete. You know, every Puerto Rican got a machete and a knife. I got my knife <laughs> and my machete. I'm telling you, prepare yourself to protect your property, your cars, your belongings, your family. You got to get ready. Stock up on food. I'm going to try to get another refrigerator, fill that up, buy a lot of cans. Um, wish they had the can can sale shop right, but it's all right. So I'm going to stock up on cans, get some meat. Um, yeah, I'm stocking up on everything. I like to drink a beer here and there, so I'm going to stock up on my brewskis. I don't, I'm not going outside. I'm going to uh, buy some gas with the Prius, bring it back, fill up the van. The Prius is filled already. Remember, everything's about to get shut down. Once everything gets shut down, gas trucks ain't coming out. It's not that many drivers, so stuff, it can't be delivered. If the 18-wheelers are not driving, we won't get anything. The 18-wheelers are the bloodline. That's how we get all our stuff. It ain't like a train could pull up at Home Depot or a boat could pull up on Home Depot. No, 18-wheelers. And if these drivers are not driving, we're not getting anything. Remember that. So all my city slickers, please protect yourself, prepare yourself. It's back. It's here. And I'm upstate because I was trying to be away from the city. It's like you can't run from it. It's all over me. Um, yeah. So prepare yourself. If they start looting where you live at, you got to put bars on your windows. Do it now. You got to put gates on your window. Do it now. Because by the time the, riot, uh, the looting start, remember, mechanics are going to be closed. You can't go get your car fixed. It's no mechanics. Everything is shut down. Nothing can open. So you got to prepare yourself, guys. Don't think the COVID thing is here and you can go buy rims, buy a system. No, everything is shut down. Who knows? Even a gas station. So fill up your cars. Have extra gas. Have a lot of food. Have whatever supplies you need. Get a first aid kit. Stuff like that. Um... I'm not going to no hospital. Something happens with us. We stand together. I'm not, we're not going to no hospital right now. 
Not, not right now, because right now there's going to be a lot of people dying. And I don't want to be one of those statistics. Statistics, not going to work. All right, guys, stock up, man. Um, this just messed me up. I'm driving back and I hear people, everybody's calling me, telling me all kind of stuff. And I'm like, Jesus, it's here already. And then you see the Jewish community rioting. I never see them rioting. So, you know, it's something. It's too much going on. But they're not going to tell us, hey, by this Friday or next Friday, everything's going to be shut down. The schools, everything. They're not going to tell you. They're just going to do it. So you see it coming. All of this that's happening are red flags. Have some common sense. Nobody's going to tell you, hey, next Friday, everything's going to be shut down. Go shopping today. No, I'm telling you, go shopping tomorrow. Go shopping tomorrow. Buy as much food as you can. Take some of your money out the bank just in case the ATMs are closed because they don't want people touching the ATM. So they're going to just shut them down. They don't want people pressing buttons. So they're going to shut it down. I don't know if I told you, all, I went to the Legoland. Ethan, yesterday, um, he May 7th, October 7th. Me, his mother, and his grandmother went to get him some stuff at Legoland. Legoland ain't taking no cash. And everybody else is going to do the same. Nobody's going to accept cash or change. I spoke to Polar Bear. He told me uh, his girl went a cute Q-tip or Q-check, Q-tip, something like that. His girl went to Q-tip, Q-check, and they told her, no change. You could pay them exact, but they're not giving you no change back. So a lot of businesses don't want to deal with money right now. So that's what I'm trying to tell you. Um, keep something in the bank just in case you could use your debit and keep some cash just in case you need cash. So you got to prepare yourself, guys. Doomsday is coming back. Remember what happened before? Everything was shut down. You, you know, you can't get your car fixed. You can't do nothing. Um, yeah, I'm bugging out. It got me paranoid. I wish I could go shopping right now, but I'm going to do that in the morning. Morning, I'm, I'm buying out. Oh, man. I'm going to buy at least, like, uh, try to get, like, 50 paper towels. Uh, and that's not enough. Because I could buy supplies for a month or two, but we're going to be shut down, I heard, to next Christmas. Something like that. I don't know. We don't know what's going on. But I think it's more to just, it's, it's more to it than what we see. You know, um, we see what they want us to see. We hear what they want us to hear. But we don't know what's going on. There's a bigger picture than this. Trust me. All right, guys, love y'all, prepare yourself, protect your family, protect your belongings, and yeah, um, if you're a single female, have something to defend yourself and your children. If you're a man, same thing, and um, stop right now, stop taking your kids to the parks, letting them play with everybody, stop that, because nobody's going to tell nobody that they got it. All right, um, let me go watch the news. Love y'all. I'll see you mañana. We like Papi Hurt. Shazam! Putting my order in tomorrow for my merch because I know they're about to get shut down again. So I want to put in a nice order real quick um, tomorrow. So if you want to pre order, let me know. I already know I got Martha Spark, I got Vanessa Rodriguez, I got Derek Young. Anybody else, let me know. Um, I'll get back with you. And uh, yeah, I'll get back with you behind the scenes. And uh, we talk. All right, guys, prepare yourself. They're not telling us when they're shutting this down. So buy as much as you can buy. I know everybody's not rich. I'm not rich. I'm still struggling. I don't get paid from YouTube. You know, I got bills. My bills, it's crazy. My bills is like 4000 a month. Crazy. So it's not like I can go in and go spend 2000 on stuff. Nobody, you know, everybody, is, we're not like you no know, upper class, the write-off. Remember I told you about those people that write off their whole life? We're not on that class. We're down here. Check the check. We're on that class. Check the check, a little bit of credit, a little bit of debit, stuff like that. 
So yeah, guys, prepare yourself. Buy what you need now. I'm stocking up on rice and beans. I don't drink coffee like that. My mother drank coffee every day. But I'm going to still get some Bustelo coffee. Never know. Buy a first aid kit. Get stuff that you need. Your girl need personal stuff for her. As a woman, get her a lot of that. You know, um, it's, you know, women at that time of the month, get them what they need. Get them boxes of that. All right, guys? Love y'all. See you mañana. Don't be there like a sitting duck, bro. Sucking your thumb. I know they're not doing that to me again. I'm not trying to wipe my butt with a brown paper bag. Nah, that's sandpaper puppy. Get up out of here later.